What is the funniest joke you've made as a result of being gay? I work in IT and we were moving offices and I was setting up a computer in a tight space so I couldn't see the back of the computer. I was having trouble getting the cable in one of the ports. My coworkers, all straight, start joking about me not being able to find the hole or get in in the hole. So I respond, I'm a bottom, I don't need to find the hole. And that is how I came out to my coworker. In medical school it was the day to practice the digital rectal exam, i.e. prostate exam. My classmates were getting nervous and I said, what if I go on autopilot and stick a second finger in there? This is just another Tuesday for me. Haha, <laughs> this happened to my ex's classmate. They were practicing and he went to use two fingers. The supervising doc was like, no, no, just one. I once changed urologists as my old one retired. He came bathing into the exam room and told me to drop my pants, underwear too. He then proceeded to feel my balls and stick a finger up my bleep. I just thought to myself that I'd had dated like that. Edit, spelling. Jeez, doc. At least take me to dinner first. God I love those gay dinner per bar jokes. Some guy was serving me and my friends. He's very British so we were talking as he was taking our order. He said no what I could really go for a fag right now and I replied with well, I'm right here. He ended up asking for my number at the end of the night so we could go out on a date but I never received a text lol. When I was coming out as bi to my parents my dad started going down the it's a choice, you're not born like this road. I cut him off and said nature versus nurture, either way it's your fault. Fortunately my parents also have a good sense of humor and were able to appreciate that one. It definitely could have backfired very easily. One time my family was visiting my grandma, who was slipping into deep senility, and she was talking about some family member ancestor of mine. At one point she goes, and you know, he was actually a rear admiral. And from the back of the car I was like oh, me too. And we all started laughing, grandma didn't get it, or maybe she did, who knows, and my mom turned around and gave me the smirking but wide mouth omg you didn't. I come from an extremely religious background and my uncle and cousin are pastors. My cousin happened to be the youth pastor at this church and I went with him for support and he started a prayer circle. So we formed a circle and they decided to get on their knees. So I piped up, whoa, this is a prayer circle? I just did this last night. Needless to say, I wasn't invited back. This is more as a result of the gay lifestyle. My buddy and I were going out to get dinner and we hooked up while I was picking him up from his house. So we finished dinner and the waitress who we've been joking around with brings the bill. I put my card on it and tell her you can just split it down the middle and he responds oh you're not gonna pay for dinner? To which I responded if you wanted me to pay, you should have waited till after dinner to put out. So I was sitting at the kitchen counter at the firehouse I used to volunteer at and I'd gotten into a car accident earlier in the day on the way in. There was like eight of us there and I said, hey, does anybody know a good body shop? I got rear-ended on the way in, and no that's not a euphemism, I don't know if everyone was just awkward or missed it, but I locked eyes with one guy and he just started laughing. I said excuse me to a woman cause she was standing in front of the cereal I wanted. She said I have a boyfriend so I snapped back so do I. And that is where my life peaked. Was driving with a couple of straight friends, Google Maps said, continue straight. I said, never. They said I should sue Google. One of my coworkers is named Gay, she called in sick for the day and I had to do part of her job as a result. One of my other coworkers came into the back room. Oh, you're gay today, Iggy I'm gay every day. We were playing softball, I had no choice, and someone was like don't worry, he'll be out. I said I've been out since 99, mother bleeper as I whacked the bleep out of that ball. IIRC it was a double two. Pretty damn epic. My senior quote was I used to be straight. I used to work in the hardware department at a retail place. My coworker walks up to me and places a level against me and says I want to measure how straight you are, I've also made several jokes that I can't do anything straight when putting up shelves that were crooked. I'm usually a homo sapiens, but when I see you, I'm a homo erectus. 
I was talking to my gay coworker about getting a work softball team together, and he said well, I've never played softball before but I am an experienced catcher. No one will ever be better at lame jokes than my dad. Family out to dinner, we drive past a new strip mall being built. Me, a bit of a jock, sees a sign for a bleep sporting goods going in, oh my god. I love bleeps. My dad, dead calm and driving, we know, son, we know. I'm a math teacher, and so there's a bunch of drawing and graphing lines. Sometimes, these lines get a little sloppy because I'm rushing. Usually goes something like, student, mister, that line isn't straight, me, straight is overrated, or, yeah well, neither am I. It's fun at the beginning of the year when only a couple of students know I'm gay and it's a bit of an inside joke. After a couple months, everyone knows and we have a lot of fun with it. To a female who tried hitting on me you're missing a few essential 6 to 8 inches. Well the best one was when I was living with roommates during uni. I was living in a mixed house of, in total, 4 guys and 4 girls. At one point, one of the girls was having some shoulder complaints and was asking me for a shoulder rub. And since my mom was a masseuse and gave me some shoulder rubs when I had some complaints, I knew what I had to do. So I gave her a little massage and she starts moaning because I was rubbing the knots out that had been bugging her all day. All I can say at that moment, with the rest of my roommates around us to hear, well, I might be gay, but I still know how to make a girl moan. That quote ended up on the wall of the living room. I do electrical work on TV and movies. I was making an quick extension cord and the female end always give me trouble. It was a rush call so I asked my friend. Can you do the female, I'm not good at it. He just looked at me and laughed. It was unplanned. I'm out but don't tell many because it's a fairly blue collar job. Funny nonetheless. I've had several medical problems within the last 13 years or so. Once, while admitted at the hospital, I had a really cute, all-American looking tech. This cute blonde girl who was my nurse had just left my room and he comes in to take my vitals and my BP and heart rate were elevated. Him, yeah it'd be easy to get excited after you see her cause she's really cute, huh? Me, a, eh, to be honest man, I'd be more apt to get a rise in BP from you than her. Him, stares blankly. I work at a restaurant in the kitchen and held the door for a waitress and she was all thanks so much, and I replied, well, I may be a princess but I was raised a gentleman. I work at the post office. There's too many package jokes to count.